Click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, welcome back in the next video on problems based on function. So today we are going to start with the sixth numerical which is based on functions. So let us start. In the previous videos, we have seen what are even functions and what are odd function. So let us check the next type that is if f of x is equal to 3x raised to 4 plus x square plus 5 minus 3 cos x plus 2 sin square x then show that f of x plus f of minus x is twice f of x. So this is a sum in which we have to prove a particular mathematical equation. So we can start with LHS first or you can start with RHS first whichever one is convenient for you. So let us start with the LHS here. So LHS we have f of x plus f of minus x. If the equation is too lengthy, you can solve f of x and f of minus x separately and then you can substitute in the LHS. So here we are going to do the same. First we will write f of x that is 3x raised to 4 plus x square plus 5 minus 3 cos x plus 2 sin square x. So this is a term which will require in the LHS. The second term is f of minus x. So f of minus x just replace x by minus x. So this is 3 minus x raised to 4 plus minus x square plus 5 is a constant minus 3 cos of minus x plus 2 sin of minus x the whole square or you can simply write sin square of minus x. Further minus x just remember friends any term having odd power and having negative sign will be negative only but if a negative term having even power will give you positive answer once again i will repeat a negative term having odd power will give you negative answer but if you have a negative term with even power you will get positive answer so here you can see you have a negative term and you have a even power so you will get a positive answer so negative x raised to 4 is positive x raised to 4 further plus minus x the whole square will give you again positive x square why because 2 is a even number and minus so negative with even power will give you positive term so plus 5 minus 3 if you know that cos of minus theta is cos theta only because cos of minus theta cos theta is also even function so cos of minus theta will give you cos theta only so this will become cos x plus 2 sin of minus theta will give you minus sin theta because sin theta is a odd function minus sin will come outside the function so sin of minus theta became minus sin theta the whole square on further solving you will get to know that this will remain 3x raised to 4 same plus x square plus 5 minus 3 cos x plus into minus before solving that you should know that minus square again minus square will be positive so this will become positive sin square x so this is plus 2 sin square x so in the LHS part we have f of x we have f of minus x ready you can take it as 1 and you can take this as 2 and then again start solving LHS so LHS was f of x and f of minus x so f of x is 3x raised to 4 plus x square plus 5 minus 3 cos x plus 2 sin square x. This part is f of x. Further we have a plus sign and then we have f of minus x. So f of minus x this is f of minus x that is 3x raised to 4 plus x square plus 5 minus 3 cos x plus 2 sin square x. Here you will notice that I have not used the brackets because there is a plus sign outside. If there was a minus sign we would use the brackets. Now we had got these values f of x and f of minus x from 1 and 2. So the reason you can mention here is from 1 and from equation number 2. Now let us collect the terms which are of the same type. So here we have 3x raised to 4 
सो यर वी हैव थ्री एक्स रेस टू फोर प्लस अगेन वन मोर थ्री एक्स रेस टू फोर प्लस एक्स स्क्वायर अगेन वन मोर टर्म प्लस एक्स स्क्वायर वी हैव अगेन प्लस फाइव विथ अनादर प्लस फाइव देन वी हैव माइनस थ्री कॉस एक्स विथ दैट वी हैव अगेन माइनस थ्री कॉस एक्स एंड प्लस टू साइन स्क्वायर एक्स एंड अगेन प्लस टू साइन स्क्वायर एक्स सो बेसिकली वी हैव रीअरेंज द टर्म्स अरेंजिंग सेम टर्म्स टूगेदर सो थ्री एक्स रेस टू फोर प्लस थ्री एक्स रेस टू फोर बोथ आर फ्रॉम सेम फैमिली सो थ्री प्लस थ्री विल गिव यू सिक्स एक्स रेस टू फोर Further x square plus x square, they have one as their coefficients. So one plus one will give you two. So this will become two x square. Again, five plus five will give you ten, and minus three cos x minus three cos x will give you minus six cos x. Further, two sine square x plus two sine square x will give you plus four sine square x. So this was the equation which was obtained from f of x plus f of minus x. Further, if you see that each coefficient is a multiple of two, so you can take two as a common. So two in bracket two threes are right. So two threes are six. This will become three x raised to four. Again plus two into one right. So this is one x square. Two fives are ten minus two threes are. So this will be three cos x and two twos are four. So this will become two sine square x, right? So this is our LHS. Now we will consider the RHS part. So what was the RHS? RHS was twice f of x. And what was f of x? That was three x raised to four plus x square plus five minus three cos x plus two sine square x. So we have LHS part and we have RHS part. This was the LHS and this was the RHS. So again from both the parts, it is clear that LHS is equal to RHS. so again this part is proved i hope friends you have understood this video thank you for watching this video stay tuned with ikida and subscribe ikida thank you